I validate my present. I am a soldier of Columbia, descended from courage, honor, and glory. I represent all those soldiers and troops who have ambitiously fulfilled their duty of fighting for freedom. Also, a handful of warriors who through time have achieved victory with honor. I am the reflection of thousands of unwavering souls who today ride within the silence of my soul and that of my country. And even though many don't see it, I must say it. Over the course of these 200 years, I have become a powerful warrior who guards the dreams of every person that inhabits this great nation. For I swore even on my life to protect the happiness, the peace, and the progress of all my brothers and sisters. Nothing's stopping me. Nothing frightens me. Nothing dims my desire to open up paths of progress and transformation for my homeland. Cold, fire, darkness, they don't scare me. Because if there's anyone I should be afraid of, it's God. Maybe you wonder where I come from or why I do what I do. I am not alone. There are many of us, all God's children and our majestic land called Columbia. We come from our farms, cities, mountains, rivers. We walked day and night across the deserts and even the high mountains. Heroes of this great nation that generation after generation have strengthened respect for the life and freedom of mothers, fathers, brothers, sisters, children, and all our Colombian people. We never feel alone. Millions of Colombians accompany us in our difficult sacrifice. That's why every breath of our troops reaches impossible places, raises hopes, and builds dreams. And although we expect nothing in return, our mission will always be the same. Give everything. We will not retreat. We will not fail. Our will and our courage will always keep us on our feet. It's been more than 200 years building and defending this great nation. That is why today I tell my country, no matter how difficult it gets, our mission will always be Veinte de julio. Numeral Libertad que une.